Hello everyone! Welcome to Cooking Caribs Coding Class. Today, I'm going to show you how to make custom scroll bars with CSS for Firefox. A while ago, I made a video about how to do it in WebKit browsers like Chrome and Safari, but that didn't work in Firefox, and it still doesn't, but now there is a way to style scroll bars in Firefox, and it looks like this. As you can see, the scroll bar has custom colors and thinner width than the default scroll bar, and that's because I made it that way. So, I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's get started. Alright, so to get started, pop open your text editor or whatever you prefer to use to write HTML. But first, I want to tell you something. This will only work on Firefox. Only Firefox. If you want to learn how to make it work on Chrome, Safari, and Opera, which are all WebKit browsers, click this card and it will take you to a video about how to use WebKit scroll bar API which only works on those browsers and no there is no way to style scroll bars in Edge or Internet Explorer but do you really want to? alright pop up a new text editor. now the first thing you want to do is make a doc type tag exclamation mark doc type HTML Next, open an HTML tag. We'll need this if we're doing custom scroll bars, although I don't usually use it. You'll want to. Now open a style tag. Style. And, you guessed it, we're going to style the HTML. HTML. Open curly braces. And on the next line, overflow dash y colon scroll. You'll need this so that the scroll bar shows up. And the default is scrolled, but the scroll bar won't always show. So you want this there so you can see your scroll bar. Great. Now, there are two different properties that style the scroll bars. Scroll bar color and scroll bar width. You can probably guess what they do. The first one we're going to do is scroll bar color. So scroll bar dash color colon. And there are two different colors in a scroll bar. There's the color of the thing that you're moving up and down and there is the color of the thing in the back. Now the first color, there are two colors that you'll put in here, and the first one is the color of the thing that you're moving around. So I'm gonna go to a color picker and choose a nice color. All right, here's the color picker. I'm gonna go, hmm, that's a nice shade of blue. Copy that, go back to your text editor, and paste in the color. Now, don't put a comma or anything, just a space in between them, and go make another color. Let's make the background like a dark purple. Like, like that. I don't want a fuchsia. Alright, I like that. Copy that. Go back to your text editor. And paste in the color. Semicolon. Alright, that's scroll bar color. For now, let's close these curly braces. Close the style tag. And before closing the HTML tag, let's put in a ton of line breaks so that there's something to scroll through. Copy that and paste it a bunch of times. Now, let's close the HTML tag. Save this file. I'm going to call it scrollbars.html. Save. Now, open a new tab in Firefox. Find the file on your computer. Here we go. And as you can see, here's our custom scroll bar right here. There's the blue that we chose, and there is the purple. And it works just like a normal scroll bar because it is a normal scroll bar. Great. Now let's do scroll bar width. It's pretty easy. Scroll bar dash width colon. And here there are three different options that you can do. Auto, which looks normal, looks like that. Thin, which is thinner, and none. Completely gets rid of the scroll bar. You can't see it, it's not there. So we already saw what auto looks like, and none is just nothing there. So let's try thin. Semicolon, save the file, go back to your browser and reload. Sorry, not your browser, Firefox. Reload, and as you can see, the scroll bar got just a tiny bit thinner, and it's a lot more apparent on Windows where the scroll bars are usually pretty fat. 
But, yeah, that's how you style scroll bars with CSS. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Buy my merch. And if you want to learn how to do this in WebKit browsers like Chrome and Safari, click on the card and watch that video.